Hey Dai, um, I'm doing a little different setup to my toilet football prediction video theory for this night episode. Since we are doing close to Halloween, I thought I have a good idea. Um, but before I tell you that idea, I have some stuff for you to follow if you have not already done it. So, if you're new to my channel, let me know below. Leave a time and saying you're new. Um, also, if you're new, turn that red to fry button, click on that, turn it from red to gray, uh, click on the bell notification next to it so you notify when I post a video because I have some epic video, epic idea coming your way in the next couple of months. Um, and before we do, go anywhere, this video a bit dumb up. Like, mash. Smash that thumb up button like you're mad at it and um then comment below that you're new comment below any video idea suggestion you have um of game praying you know anything because i will take those suggestions and i will actually film it for you guys so you guys can watch it so now that we got that out of the way um Let's get on to what the, this next episode of Tyler Papa Fiction will be. So, then Halloween is literally in, I want to say in, it's in five days. So, then Halloween in five days. I thought I would do it a little differently. So instead of me doing the toilet football edition, I have a little death that would be coming on and tell you, telling you who's gonna win and who's gonna lose this weekend. And um, if you don't know who that death is, just leave it in the comment. But um, let me just so call him up because he has to talk to you. So let me. Uh, See you guys in the clip. Or would it be me? <laughs> so, uh, let me know. Alright? So, keep on watching the mystery of who's gonna give you the winning and losing game of Tyler Football this weekend. Is it gonna be a bunch of it of Thomas? Or what? Alright. Let's get on. All right, guys, uh, like I told you, somebody was going to tell you this weekend winning and losing teams. And it wasn't going to be eventually by Thomas. So, welcome to this episode for Halloween. I'm Jeff Dalton. One night... Before Christmas, if you like seen the movie, if you haven't, don't do it, or something bad will gonna happen to you. All right, uh, Thomas told me to tell you that he's gonna be winning and losing this weekend in college football. So let's get right to it with Utah and UTL. I have no idea what football is, so I'm gonna just take a random death. Um, I'm gonna say Utah is gonna beat UTL. Um, the next matchup for the return is Clemson and FSU. And ask me, I know about Clemson. I heard about him from my graduation. Clemson's gonna win. 
when time then in northern western um Thomas did mention me to tell you that, that when Thompson had a really good game last week, that game was a good game to watch if anybody was watching it. So I'm going to say when Thompson's going to play like they did last week, and when Thompson's going to take W. Alright, this next game, it's going to be a nail biting down to the wire, but somebody who haven't watched before, yeah, myself, I'm going to say, no biting, but Georgia is going to find a way to come out on top over Florida, Iowa, and Penn State, ooh, I don't know what I'm going to see here, um, you're going to be watching a Good, good game. This game is gonna be a damn a nail biter. This game is gonna be a fighting game. So um, let me tell you right here. I'm gonna put. Oh, this is tough. This is tough. Uh, but somebody who don't know about football. Just by looking at Penn State and Iowa, ooh, oh man, this is a toughie. Um, but I'm gonna say Penn State's gonna win it by two. The next game, Tennessee State versus Oklahoma. Um, this might be a slow answer on who's gonna take the W. Oklahoma, one of the top five teams, they're going to take another W, add to their western to make them 8-1. So Oklahoma, Jack Dalton have picked you to go win it. You are up and Houston. Oh, Houston, we got a problem. They're going to take the W this week. With the Jack Dalton the Doe. The Tutty in Missouri? Ooh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Well, uh. My wife said something about this game. Um, she said I should pick the Tutty. The Tutty's gonna win. So. Is that true? I think it is. So, Tatati's gonna win. Washington and Tally. Ooh. Tally's an awesome place. Nice warm weather. Ah. Uh, and then you're stuck in New York. What are you thinking? Alright, that's off topic. Tangent. <laughs> that Dalton Tangent just the story we in mind. It's getting a little floaty Halloween, so he's kind of just uh, out of it, but uh, back to it. Washington vs. Tally. Um, I think Tally's going to win. Tally got the game. Yep. Nothing. Tuck boy it up. It's Texas A&M. And Michigan. Mississippi State. Hmm. Ah, uh, I think my uh, I'm a little hungry, so I think my dot is standing uh to pick Tasha Hay and I'm. So uh, yeah, Tasha Hay and I'm. Jack Dalton has told you to win. Washington State both Stanford. Stanford, Stanford is one of the top five teams, according to what Thomas told me. So I'm going to pick Stanford to win, win against Washington State. So Stanford, go out there like it's just another thing to you. North Carolina State versus Derrick Shoes. 
I heard there she was in your backyard, huh? Well, uh, I think uh, North Carolina State is going to win that one. But um, it won't be until like the last minute when they pulled poll by like three points. Oh, this next one is gonna be a uh, one to pay attention to. Jeff Dalton is coming live to you from Notre Dame versus the Navy. Ooh, this is gonna be a toughie. I don't think Jeff Dalton to give you an answer on this one. Um, all I gotta say is, it's gonna be a nail biter. And, um, but I'm gonna say, the defense, it's gonna be a defense today. So if you wanna, if you enjoy watching defense, tune in to Notre Dame vs. Navy on Saturday at 3 o'clock. The next one is Oklahoma State vs. Texas. And, um, Jeff Dalton gonna give Texas another W. Um, so, Texas, go out there Saturday and show Jeff Dalton that you're gonna win for him. The last thing. I don't know if it's going to be a good game or not. Um, it's Oregon versus Arizona. Um, I, uh, I'm looking at the, uh, how they both played last week. And this is a 10-30 game. So it might be an 8.30 game if they're playing on the West Coast. Um, I'm gonna go... Jeff? Jeff Dalton to the pit? One more, please! Jeff Dalton to the pit! Order to win against Eliona! And, uh... Oh, huh, 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 uh huh, ah, uh, ah, uh, yeah, mm-hmm, all right, see, well, uh, I lost the, the Baylor vs. West Virginia game, um, they, uh, Jeff Dalton went to Baylor, he's an alumni now, I'm just kidding, he's not, he, he did not want to, uh, Baylor, he likes to show around. That's what he uh, Jeff Dalton do. He likes to show. He wanna have fun, man. He wanna have fun. But uh, that's the best in football. Uh, Baylor voted West Virginia. Jeff Dalton and Donald Pitt. West Virginia over Baylor. Over his alumni. And uh. The last thing, uh, it, uh, played by Georgia Dardenau with the Appalachian State, and, uh, Jeff Dalton is feeling that Georgia Dardenau is going to win. Isn't that right? Yeah. All right, guy. Well, uh, I don't know how you end the video. Um, but I just want to tell you guys that, uh, Happy Halloween! And, uh, don't get too theory about all this. I'm Jeff Dalton. I'm friendly. I, and I'm not here to dare you. Or am I? Am I here to dare you? I'm... Am I? Am I? Wait a minute, how was going to say anything about that? He just told me to talk about football. But am I here to tell you? Hmm. 
<laughs> Happy Halloween! Yeah, Dollar Two is out. <laughs> oh, hey, guy. So, uh, I hear that Jack Dullington stopped by. That was pretty cool. I did not request that, but he called me up and said that he wanted to see this toilet for football position. So, um, I hope you die if we with what he say. We said you should. We said that. I don't know if something's gonna. I don't know, happen? We all are five days away from ha Halloween. So maybe you should if we were him. But, uh, I don't know. Let me know down below if, uh, Jack Dullington did a good job. Maybe I should. Maybe he should stop by a den and do, like, uh, I don't know. Maybe a week down in December? Hmm. Let me know below if you think he did a good job. Um, but yeah, that, that was unexpected. I was planning on doing it myself, but then all of a sudden, Jack Dullington half my camera and just wanted to do it. So, yeah. So, uh, so done, he's done. Well, uh, I'm hot on here to slow down the video. But not for long, because I'm, I'm always coming back and making more video for you guys. Which are leaving the time, like I said before. Let me know any video adjustment you want me to do. Um, I have some epic ones that I'm going to be filming, but I can always add joy to the list to make it more interactive, to make it more entertaining. So let me know. Um, and also, before we leave, remember to enjoy the little thing in life. Because you should, instead of, I don't know, I don't know what I'm doing at. Uh, remember to enjoy the little thing in life. Don't take life for granted. And go out there every day, wake up every day, go out there, have fun, and make sure you're doing something that you enjoy. Don't do something that is boring, don't do something that make you have a lot of class or something that you need to do because you need to survive. No. Go out there every day and find something you enjoy and just live every day to the fullest. Come on, people. Live happy. Don't live in class. Don't live in class for situation. So yeah. Um, I will see you die in the next video. So I hope you and like Shaft Dellington giving you the prediction for the week. Um, and I guess that's all I have for now. But don't worry, because it's not forever. I will be back. I'll probably be back tomorrow. So peace out, boys.